Now, today's top stories and power of five weather from News 5. A change in our air for today, a lot less in the way of humidity and cooler temperatures as well. Highs only around 70 to 72 and a pretty strong northwest wind, plus a few pop up lake effect rain showers from time to time. And on occasion, the wind may gust close to 25 miles an hour, so it may feel a little chilly today. Very un summer like, but don't worry. This little fall preview only lasts a day or two. Sunshine 78 on Thursday back into the 80s for Friday pushing toward the upper 80s by Sunday and Monday. Mona and Terrence here with the top stories for Wednesday. The driver of an SUV is in critical condition at a hospital this morning. He crashed the vehicle on the Pearl Road Bridge in Cleveland, almost falling off the edge overnight. But the crash did knock debris from the bridge onto rail tracks below. The post office couldn't reach a lease agreement in North Canton, so it's closing Saturday. We don't know if it will reopen. That closure won't affect mail delivery in the city, but P.O. boxes will be moved to the main office in Canton. An investigative team is meeting with the Board of Trustees at Ohio State. They'll talk about how Urban Meyer handled domestic violence allegations against a former assistant coach. Meyer's future at the school will ultimately be up to the school's president. Those are your headlines. Get the latest news anytime on the News 5 app and our website. Have a great day.